law enforcement authorities in London are immediately saying that this is being treated like a terror attack, although this happened right in the same spot, essentially, where there was a major terror attack like that, a very similar attack back in March of last year, where you'll recall, uh, I think it was Khalid Masoub or was, was the guy's name, plowed into uh, pedestrians, did the same thing, killing several people and uh, then got out and started stabbing people. And uh, the, the, the difference that we see with this attack and the last one is that when Khalid Masoub start, got out and started stabbing people, the first person he killed was, an, was a police officer who was on duty but did not have a weapon. Uh, there, it just was mind-boggling to me that Great Britain still has police officers that wander around with no way to protect their citizens. They, they, they're completely unarmed. And this time, the, the police response was very swift, and it was with armed officers. They got that guy out of the car, and he's now in custody. In his, in his late 20s, we hear, uh, and uh, we don't know a whole lot more about him, and so we'll reserve judgment uh, from then on. But this, this makes four ramming attacks in Great Britain over the last 12 months or so, just uh, maybe uh, 15 months, uh, and uh, three of them, at least, were, were terrorism.